Welcome to Career in Blockchain. In this video, I'm talking to Yip, which is the co-founder of the Blockchain Unit Network. She's telling us about her journey of building a blockchain and of building a whole ecosystem around it. Hi, Yip. I'm very, very happy that you're on Career in Blockchain today. Welcome. And let's start right away. Can you tell us exactly what you do? So what you're building right now, I know you have a lot of initiatives. Can you maybe like put a name on it and tell us what you do? Um, I'm at Unit Network and Unit Network is a layer one solution. And we are solving one big problem, which is bringing transparency to the market, right? On a, like, you know, on a vision level. On a vision level, we are here to solve or to create a world which there is zero inequitability anymore, where people can participate freely in the economy in the way they find most meaningful. And we're developing the tech solution for that. So how do you mean financial, financial inclusion? You mean that? Financial inclusion, but you know, internet of value goes beyond profits, right? We're talking here, Web3 is the internet of value, but value is more than profits. So in the token economy, or using token as a vehicle, you can actually think about ways of how to reward people, like how to reward collaboration in a more, I would say, efficient way than we've done for using profit metrics in the world so far. I think that goes beyond the scope of our discussion here to go about internet of value and um, its value for creating the contributor economy of tomorrow. Actually, but what we're doing basically is, yes, we provide a layer, a tech-based layer that enables people to participate and yeah also financially be rewarded for the work that they put in and financially meaning beyond what we currently think about us dollar based or fiat based as reward mechanism mm. you can think about a token as a vehicle that contains or um, represents value that goes from a to b freely in a borderless economy okay and you have several initiatives how to support the unit network and how to develop the unit network can you tell us about them yeah <laughs> so unit network you can imagine is this a blockchain on which people can issue their own tokens and why i said earlier that we provide transparency to the market is when you issue a, a token through the unit network you have a feature that says hey you can lock up the value created, the fundamental value created through your token project. Because in the future, we envision that you know a lot of small, medium enterprises, like long tail tokens, as we call it in the field, would be able to enter the blockchain economy. So it's not only this kind of fast project that just like drop an NFT and then raise a lot of money and there's no fundamental value behind it. But companies like um, hairdressers, restaurants, whatever, uh, milkshake businesses, I, I don't know, people that have a business, right, that really want to issue a token, tap into this borderless economy, can issue a token and they can signal to the world community what is the fundamental value backing their business because they will have business streams, recurring business streams, a revenue streams that they can then lock into the treasury and the treasury will grow over time. And this growth of the treasury over time will signal actually that this is a valid, a sound project. And this project is backed by digital assets that do have a certain value. So you as a token owner, you can decide, hey, which project am I actually putting my funds in? Do I put, do I support a project, you know, that is 100% speculative value, which is like actually every project currently listed on CoinMarketCap. We don't know what is the fundamental value behind it, but, or do I put my money into a project that is run by my friends, a project that supports a cause that I really care about, a project that has solid fundamentals, and I can see it because the team grew the treasury over time. So me as a token supporter, to support that, I also know that the value of that token project is not zero, but it has like a you know, fundamental value, which is the bottom price. And, and this is basically what we're doing within UNIT to build the token economy. And then now, how do we help to spread the token economy? These are all the initiatives where you can like participate in whatever way you want to. And the first entry point typically that people have with units is either through our education program called Unit Masters or through our unit conferences. Unit conferences are conferences that go for one day. We have 
40 conferences in Q4, actually this year almost every day actually. And then we do this conference series every six months. And this is where the entire unit community plus other communities come together and learn together about things that move and shape and shape the ecosystem. And then we have unit masters, which is like a six weeks program. It's a blockchain literacy program called Fundamental Programs. And we designed it in a way that it's zero exclusive. Zero exclusive means everyone can participate because it's free of cost. But we designed it in a way that it you know, would be considered one of the best programs in the market, but you don't have to pay for that because we actually do need people who would not be able to afford this program to join the blockchain economy so that it can be shaped by like a diversity of opinions and skill sets and expertise. So we have to find mechanisms to incentivize people to join in. And then there's also mental well-being and community building included in that six weeks curriculum. So it's not only about, like I said earlier, not about profits and so on, but actually how do you build an economy that serves society and nature and not how do we serve that technology? It doesn't make sense. And it goes beyond just blockchain that technology, like tech fundamentals, but it looks at economy as a whole. And how can you find your spot in that economy? And then we have a range of other initiatives. We have the Ventures Program, where we offer a 10 weeks program to help token issuers um, issue and then like, think about how to issue that token and also distribute that token. That will be launched next year. So currently, we're in the final design stage of it. And I think we already collected 30, 30 applications, like 30 participants for the third unit Ventures batch. Okay, so the, you basically try to cover the whole life cycle of, of, of the token economy, you know, from education to actually issuing the tokens. Do you have your own software to issue the tokens or, or can you like briefly tell us how, how does that work? Oh, it can, like you can issue the token, like currently the issue is everyone can issue a token anywhere, right? But you need to know how to code. Yeah. So. What we envision with unit network is, you know, you don't, it's the way of WordPress revolutionized, let's say, website programming. Earlier, you had to learn how to code HTML in order to create your own site. But now we have solutions where you can just plug in and then within three hours, you can have a very nice looking website. Or how Figma helped, like, you know, you UI designers to create beautiful things and already create the code behind it so that it can be deployed very fast. So in unit network, you can go to unit network right now. We're not live yet. So you can not get in without the invite. And that is like given to, to people to test it only. Um, and then you issue your own token and then you have ways to um, create the entire governance around your token too, right? I said the treasury is one part, but then you have polls and you have voting mechanism, you have news which is a way to do your customer relationship management of the project team to um, inform the community about what's happening and also to provide some more, um, I would say, background to help people, you know, give you, give you their assets and support your project. And you can recruit, so you can create bounties, like this contest are like the bounty system where you can issue, like you can give out um, projects that you need to be to have done for your project and people can apply for them and do the bounties and then receive some tokens. So it's an entire full-fledged kind of platform mm. to, to do that. Okay, and it sounds like a lot of work. Can you tell us about your team? Yeah, we are a decentralized autonomous organization in that sense, we're a collective of change makers from across the globe. And we have a team in Bali, for example, we have a team in Europe, we have a team in the Americas. And we are currently more than 50 people already, of which a significant number of people are also pioneers. Pioneers is our three-month program to onboard the unit as a core team member. After three months, we can basically decide if you want to stick with the unit core team and help build the economy of the future. So it's kind of a risk-free yeah, way to settle in, in, into the process of working in a decentralized autonomous organization. There is one more thing that you mentioned earlier, the unit ventures. Can you also tell a little bit about this pillar of the unit network? Yeah. So you already rightfully mentioned that we have this entire life cycle, right? It's called the unit live wheel, where basically people can enter the economy, like go to our conferences and hear the different projects that are built in other, in, in different ecosystems, but also in the future on the unit ecosystems. 
then they can do the master's program to upskill themselves and learn about how can I actually survive and actually thrive in this blockchain economy if I'm not necessarily a tech person, right? What, what are my opportunities? How do I become blockchain literate or gain fluency in speaking blockchain language? And then basically when you decide that, oh, I actually now I feel really ready. I want to issue my own token. I want to become a token entrepreneur. And basically you can apply to Unit Ventures program. And Unit Ventures program is a 10 weeks program where you go through a structured approach of how to think about setting up your decentralized token project. How do you recruit and organize your team members? We have a very special framework called MLPS, Marketing Organization Product Sales. We think you need to have at least these fundamental pillars within every kind of autonomous project to make sure that you, know, you can deliver in small teams that are autonomously working, but then in the end have to contribute to a bigger, bigger picture. So you will learn about these kinds of methodology, we connect you to different members of the crypto economy that would provide with the funds. Right? So how do we do a fundraise? You get lecturing or mentoring by people who've been in the field in that industry that you are going for. The website is unit.ventures and I hope we can launch like the application field very soon and that will be like four projects issuing their tokens on the unit network. Great, thank you Yip for this amazing summary and overview of how to build a blockchain basically. Yeah, and thank you Maria for contributing to our ecosystem. You were like a really strong pillar in the World Solana Forum, got a lot of traction. So thanks a lot thank for you. being part of, part of our movement. Thank you.